I was once a teacher inside a four-cornered room, walking from building to building, greeting everyone as I pass, shaking hands sometimes. I am waiting to finish a class before I enter, holding a shock in my hands, writing with a pen and paper, and talking with my students face to face. And that day, Everything has changed. There's a rumor that notify everyone to stay at home, to not walk from a public place to another, to not greet using handshake. That's the effect of pandemic. That is the power of COVID-19. I am saddened that many establishments were closed. I am unhappy that many people were hungry as they suffered due to no work. I am afraid that my students weren't going to learn because of academic freeze. Despite that, Filipinos are optimistic. We look for things which we can be productive. In educational aspect, Department of Education Region 4A Calabarzon launched Pivot 4A Cube, which aims to provide the quality of basic education in Southern Tagalog to support Sulong Edukalidad program. DEPED implemented different memorandums to assure that every teacher is ready in this new normal. Such memorandums are Regional Order No. 10, Series of 2020, Regional Memorandum No. 296, Series of 2020, and Regional Memorandum No. 322, Series of 2020. Through MELC, or Most Essential Learning Competencies, it addresses learners' needed skills to compete independently and globally. Teachers, on the other hand, prepare lesson exemplars using the ICLEA framework or intent, content, learning experiences, and assessment utilizing the IDEA format or introduce, develop, engage, and assimilate to produce one concrete plan for all. To add more, involving themselves to learn voluntarily by attending webinars would be a great help to discover new things and share it to co-workers, students, and the rest of the society. There are also virtual meetings as to update the plans for the coming school year. You may feel the pressure today, but whatever happens, I will still be a teacher, willing to learn, willing to help, and willing to teach. I am a teacher of Sinaloa Integrated National High School, always ready, even in this new normal.